Hey loves and welcome back to another hair install review video and this hair is from IC Hair. This is their kinky curly hair in 20 inches. In this video I'm going to be unboxing it, showing you guys exactly what comes in the package that is sent me as well as showing you the details and sharing with you the details of this week and doing a quick installation customization process. Hey, so we're gonna start up this with the unboxing. Now for anyone who is not new here, you already know the drill. However, if it's your first time stopping by, I'm gonna show you the entire unboxing experience with this brand and this product. Now in this box, they did send this M cap wig cap, and this is the cap that the wig was made on. You do have removable combs as well as adjustable bands. It is very snug and comfortable. They also sent this hair bonnet, details about the M cap as well as some replacement accessories. In this bag we do have extra elastic band and extra combs for that extra security. We also have some HD wig caps and some eyelash. Now this is why you are here. This one is the kinky curly hair from Icy Hair and it comes in the length of 20 inches. I'm going to unbox this and show you guys what it looks like. This is what the lace closure looks like. It is a 9 by 6 closure hair. See the hairline it does come pre-cut, pre-plucked, pre-bleached and it's pre-ready for you to just install. Now this is the adjustable elastic band as well as the removable clip. So you can remove this if you feel like you don't want anything poking behind you or you can put this on if you want that extra security as well. Now this is the length of the closure guys it is quite wide the parting space is wide this is what the curl pattern looks like and also what the length of this hair looks like beautiful right also what the lace looks like it pretty much blends into my skin with a little bit of customization it will look perfect now moving on to installation you guys know i don't like wasting time i don't like any wig that that requires a lot of time wasting so i'm going to go straight into installing this because it takes me about less than 10 15 minutes to do this so i'm just putting this on my head i hardly ever use wig caps because i just don't like how it looks so with this hair it is pretty much wear and go you can put this on and be out the door you don't need to style this you don't need to you know straighten it you don't need to do anything to it you can put this on and be out the door in seconds and this is what it looks like without doing any work of any sort just so you guys can see i have not laid this down it is not glued on it is not stuck on i can move this around and yeah but because we want to give this the best shot i'm going to go ahead to use my melting spray this one is the ebbing spray and i just wanted to get that melted look right and i wanted this to stick on on my head for maybe a day or two right so i'm going to have to be using this spray it is like a a light to medium hold so you can remove this using water and that's what i like about it right so i'm just pressing this down just so it melts into my skin and pushing the hair back i'm also going to be using my melting band to also melt this guys because of how tiny the knots are you do want to be careful with it with how you handle the lace now i'm going to go ahead to style this hair but i want you guys to take a look at the curl pattern right you can leave this hair as it as is or you can go ahead to define it and customize it using some water conditioner some mousse as well so again like i said this is what the curl pattern looks like beautiful this is the volume of the hair straight out of the bag however we're going to be adding more volume because we want to comb this out but also define the curls and to do that i'm going to be using some water as well as some mousse and some serum i'm going to drench this hair with a lot of moisture because this hair really comes alive with moisture it comes alive with water right water activates it water revamps it water just brings out the true you know texture right so I'm just damping this 
you know saturating this with a lot of water you can use water and conditioner you can use water and mousse you can just use only water depending on what you want but i'm going to be using a combination of products i'm going to be using water and then i'm going to be using mousse to help define the curls and i'm going to be using my hair serum to also help add that moisture and shine as well now i finger combed it and this was the shedding right the hair did shed just a little bit and i showed you guys what it looked like right so i'm just finger combing this hair and getting you know it saturated getting it wet <laughs> and you guys can already see how the curls are coming in as i'm finger combing this so i'm going to be using my mousse as well like i said and this is going to help you know that curls pop even more it's gonna help it look luscious <laughs> it's gonna help it look a lot more luscious and it just makes the hair come alive i'm also going to be using a serum as well to add shine and to lock in all of that moisture so that way it looks good all day so that's what i'm going to be doing throughout my hair i'm also going to be using this paddle brush to just brush out the curls but also you know define the curls as well i don't know how to explain this to you but it does like it's two in one right so i'm brushing out the curls so that way it's more voluminous but at the same time it is defining the curls as well now look at what it looks like before the water and product and after you guys can see the volume right so yeah before and after yeah whichever way they both look amazing i'm gonna go ahead to do the same thing on the other side and let you guys watch through this this is what we are looking like right now this hair is so gorgeous but it also requires a little bit of work to bring out the beauty and this is what we're looking like right now i feel like my face looks flat right to correct this i'm going to be creating a bit of layers just to frame my face a little bit more and i'm going to be sectioning the front part so that way when i style the hair it's going to fall beautifully framing my face so i'm using a pair of scissors just gonna snip snip cut it downward so that way we have that layered look like you're seeing right now do the same thing on the other side just gonna trim this down and yeah so with this you can do like a fringe if you want a fringe you can just create like side bangs like i'm doing right here layers basically and this is what i'm doing so yeah this is what it looks like when it does dry down it it will shrink a bit it will get a bit shorter it will lose some inches but it will still look gorgeous regardless so what i want to do now is to just customize the lace and i want it to blend with my skin tone now look at it you can barely even see the lace but because we want this to be looking like perfection we're going to be using my contour powder I'm just dabbing a little bit of that contour shade onto the lace and ba ba boom we're done <laughs> we're good um the last thing i want to do is to further melt the baby hair i want to melt the front part of the closure guys this look at how the look at look, look at how plucked it looks right you want to be very delicate with how you handle this wig if not you're going to end up ripping off all the close your hairs in front so take your time be very gentle because again these are tiny knots and they are very delicate as well now this is what the hair is looking like after a couple of minutes letting this melt down and look at this gorgeousness look at it look at that melt <laughs> and guys this is the final look i'm just gonna head to just fluff this up and this is what it looks like or just you cannot tell me anything look at the curls the volume absolutely love it 
all my kinky girlies out there this one is gorgeous this hair again is from IC hair and it's that kinky curly hair in 20 inches this is this 9 by 6 m cap wig and absolutely love it so this is what this hair is looking like after installation this is the end of this video so i definitely love the volume of this hair and if you know icy hair you know that installing it is always a breeze and easy i could have done the glueless method but i went ahead to use a little bit of holding spray just so it melts down perfectly it was very quick very easy and again it is a wear and go it is pre-styled pre-plucked pre-bleached pre everything pre ready for you to basically install it took me less than 30 minutes to do the whole process it is a nine by six closure so you do have a lot of parting space i don't know if you guys can see let me come a bit closer right so it starts from here and also ends here at the, same, at the same time so you can do like a deep side part with this you can style it however you want you can do like an up down half up half down hairstyle however you want to style it you can definitely do it with this wide part and again with this m cap it is very snug it is very comfortable on my head at the same time and it just fits perfectly to be honest with you i feel like with this hair you do have to work a little bit extra hard to get it to you know look the way it's supposed to look because you do have to brush it out with products with water to activate the curls and all that and i had to also frame this wig as well so that way it will fit my face giving myself a little bit of a bang over here so it kind of falls beautifully around the perimeters of my face if i wanted to do like a, a fringe style i would just typically like you know bring it to the front maybe cut up a little bit but i love how it looks right now gorgeous <laughs> let me know your thoughts are down in the, in the comment section i'll leave all the links to this unit and more down in the description box be sure to check it out all the details will be down there as well and yeah i'll see you guys in the next one till then make sure you stay blessed and you stay fabulous bye guys <laughs>